This is England's new all-white home kit, unveiled by Nike with much fanfare today, boasting subtle details on the shoulders and crest, but with a rather less subtle price tag, which has caused a fanfare all of its own. The new shirts are now for sale on Nike's website. You'll need to find £90 for the match shirt, and a kit for children aged 3 to 8 will cost you £40. And if you have more than one child, well, you can do the maths. Just how expensive is it to be an England fan this World Cup? Well, if you support Germany, you can save a third. Their shirt's just £60. But if you're supporting host nation Brazil, it's the same price. And if you're cheering for Italy, you can get saving. Theirs is a whopping £120. Is this crazy money or do fans think it's worth it? So scandalous, it should, should never be. It's really unfair. A lot of people, especially the poor off, they can't afford to buy shirts like that and they pay that sort of money. I think it's a lot of money and it makes it very unfair for the less fortunate to be able to put in the position to be able to afford that. It will put a lot of pressure on people, especially with children, because they want to keep up with you know, their peers and there are going to be certain children that will be excluded from that. £90 is a lot of money. So what shirt's that? Ah, it's a Dutch shirt. And how much did you pay for it? £75. Euros. Would you pay £90 for the England shirt? I would. Why is that? I like to support England when I'm abroad. And you think it's worth £90 for a football shirt? I think it's expensive, but I think that if you support a team, then uh, yeah, I would say yeah. Footballers have offered their pennies worth. Joey Barton tweeting, appalling in my opinion. Football again allows commercialism to eat away at its soul. Something has got to give. Stan Collymore tweeted a photo of a shirt he'd mocked up himself. Just saved myself 90 sheets. Come on, England. Unable to afford the flight to Brazil, most England fans will watch the World Cup from home this summer. And for many, they may not be able to afford the shirt either. Sally Lockwood, 5 News.